Okay guys, let's do a fast review about how you can register to this broker ForexMart. You just can click here or copy the link. I'm going to copy and paste it in a new Google Chrome uh, browser. So copy paste. And the only thing that we have to do is to fill out the personal details, all right? I'm going to do that in a new uh, account and basically you have to do the same the full name your uh, telephone number your date of birth additional information about where, where do you live uh, don't care about this message it's not uh, about you just remind it's a reminder in case that you are uh, american citizen and that's it then you would click next i'm going to do it and then we continue once we finish with the registration, this is what we are going to find. We have two accounts type, all right? Uh, then we have to select the one that uh, we want to use. In this case, I recommend to you to use the classic one, but it's up to you. You can read the conditions and choose the one that you think is better for you. So once you click on select, it's going to be in blue. That's the one that you're going to select. And then you can also choose the uh, currency, for example, dollars, and also the uh, maximum leverage that you want to get on the trading. I would recommend the maximum, yes, 500 to one. And then swap free. Also, you should click on swap free, all right? And then you have to uh, basically, uh, that's, you can keep it and submit once you submit you're going to get a an email so this is the details once you have finished to uh, be able to open your account here you have your account number your trade password and everything so write it down also you are going to get an email with all the detail details so don't worry about it So now what you have to do to go to the WebTrader platform, just write down that your account number and your trader password in the sign in to client area and click on go to cabinet. This is the first thing that you're going to find that you need to submit your documents enable uh, in order to be able to be verified by uh, the company. But you don't need to do it right now, straight away. You can do it later it's no problem this is my main uh, panel where I have different options but let's focus uh, in the how we can go to the web terminal here on the left you can find web terminal if you click here it's going to open a new a new tab and automatically is going to connect because uh, this is your server uh, this is like very a simulation of MetaTrader 4 but in a web trader for me it's quite comfortable and I hope for you too and this is the platform that we are going to operate in this case uh, this is the uh, previous this is sorry <laughs> because I have two accounts right now but uh, it opened my my real account that I was uh, operating, but basically you need to, uh, when you click in a web terminal, it's going to ask you again for your details that you get in your email. So you need just to, to provide these details and then you're going to, to get, to, you're going to access to this web terminal in the specific account, all right? So now that we are here, uh, I'm going to show you the basics to know how we are going to operate. Uh, basically, uh, he, there is um, a few things that you need to know. There is many things, don't worry, uh, that you can see uh, at the beginning, but we are going to focus just in the, in the most important. Uh, here on the left, you have the, the symbols that we are going to use, but probably you're not going to find all of them, just a few ones. In case that you don't find the one that we are going to use, if you click with the right click 
uh, right button of your mouse and click on symbols, you're going to be able to uh, to add uh, some of them that, for example, they are in gray, it means that they are not here. If you click on them and then in show, it's going to appear here after, all right? So this is the uh, graphic uh, that is with the pair, uh, the pounds with um, Australian dollars. So we can do it bigger, we, we can zoom it so we can have a better look of the price in this pair and also do it smaller all right uh, here uh, we can open different uh, pairs so you can see here there is the euro dollar the pounds dollar so all of them are safe and you can open anytime so it's quite easy if we want to open an order or an instant operation so for example we go to uh, the per euro dollar and we could just click here new order and this is the, uh, the specific place where you can set all the details basically uh, i'm going to tell you what is the volume that you should uh, open the operation that it means the, the, the total of the money that you're, we are going to use for the operation then here in the type if it's spending order it means that we uh, the operation is going to be uh, in a specific point uh, in specific price all right so if it's instant instant execution sorry for my pronunciation uh, it's going to be straight away uh, in the price that is right now the uh, the pair so for example, let's do uh, a, let's let's go to a buy right now, and so if we want to do that, we specify the volume, the stop loss. We are going to, for example, put it in uh, like this. All right, and the take profit, for example, uh, stop loss is not correct should be like this because it should be under if we are going to buy if you are going to buy then uh, the stop loss should be under and if we are going to sell stop loss should be over okay and take profit let's put it like like this okay perfect in this case so we can buy and that's it okay we have our order here and we can follow it at the same time so we have here the stop loss the take profit and with the right click we can actually modify it close it or open a new order uh, here also another button where we can open a new graphic and that's it that's the most important that you should know and and in any case of course you should let me know uh, if you have any doubt here also we can select uh, the candles um, uh, the, the candles time and this is is in a one minute but we can also set it in five minutes 15 minutes one hour for example okay it's up to you but we are usually going to check it at first one minute or uh, 15 minutes something like that and that's it guys i hope uh, it's clear and we can start soon i'm really looking forward